What is happening, y'all? Welcome back. Time to tackle part two of the cathedral. Gotta be honest, I'm pretty pumped for the boss fight. Mainly because this thing is going to be the destroyer of beacons. It is just going to cleave every single one of those caped bastards. Screw that guy. Last time, get to shoot me with a bolt. They're usually a. Let's see what those do now. Alright, still just a faithful thing. You have more poise than me. Alright, come on, buddy. Come on out of there. If you do not come out, I will turn this car around. No! No! Bad monk. Dead monk. Alright, I'm trying to remember how I typically clear this. God, dude, that dark damage on roll is delicious. I can't get over it. You were close, but you weren't good enough. Nothing is good enough to stop Fire Scythe Man. Tight Night Shard... Just run on up and take you down. Hood. Oh. Okay. Yeah, if you guys want to drop down, that's that's fine. I'm totally on board with that. Less for me to fight and all. That's, you know, that's nice. Oh, this is the one I was thinking of. Arbalest. Darkness rolls. I am tempted to try a combination of that with Thorn's armor and see if I am just like the Lord of Rolls. This one is a Yeah. Thought I remember people showing up. Alright. Uh so that that that. I swear more of these used to be open. Alright, first thing is first. Let's air view. Leave your Oh god no. Oh my god. Oh my god. Guts Jr. over here, ladies and gentlemen. Oh. Oh god, the panic rolls killed him. That was oof. That was scary. can just all right all I need to do is position myself in a way where he's gonna fall off trying to hit me no not what I wanted to do I was basically the exact opposite of what I wanted to do damn it 
tried to be, tried to be, uh, fucking cheeky. I was like, yeah, he's gonna swing and he's gonna, nope, just kidding. He's not gonna fall anywhere. My ass is gonna fall. Well, you know, to be fair, I got the item. I might just go for a run and jump. Because these guys are always really irritating to deal with. Because you got the sword guy chasing you, and then the other one, and just trying to get past them, and it never works out right. Yeah, I think I, I will do that. I'm gonna wait till we get hit a little bit, pop our ember, fill up. think they're coming down. Yeah, somebody doesn't like fire, do they? Thorn stuff is usually here, but he never spawned to invade us. And don't I get the covenant from talking with No, the item is over here. No, wait, that's that's the red eye orb that's over here. Let me talk to her anyway. Yes. Nasty. Just sitting here playing with those little things. Alright, what do we get? So, this one was up in an FP. Amount of souls? What? Yes, let's go. It's like freaking Silver Serpent Ring, but as a covenant, I'm all about that. Imagine what a good change that would have been in Four Dark Souls. There would have been so many reds. It would have been just like a massive, massive boost to the PvP. Patches isn't here. Charm. Doesn't matter, but I'll open it because why the hell not? You know, either my dude is incredibly strong or these doors are on some really, really good hinges. Which is not. 
I guess now that I've unlocked this area, maybe it does. That's right, doesn't Patches pull it down from over there? I need to focus on stamina too. Maybe two levels, two levels into bigger. It's 15 is like a nice, nice break point. Um, then after that, I think I'm gonna focus on getting my stamina up a good bit. I don't need it like up at 40 or anything, but shit, how rude. I'll try and get it up at least to 20. Like, I at least want it to catch up to my FP bar. Right, here we go. Some of them are quite resilient. Others are scrubs. Which is interesting. They like changed up the fight to have a couple that were on the gear side of things. Looks like this is a much more about targeting the red versus. So I, I used to just like perpetually wipe out everything. And, oh my god. I think maybe the big ones don't respawn now. I was just about to heal. Oh my god. I was. I'm, I'm liking this though. This is uh, because like I said previously, fucking deacons were a complete joke. You would just show up and be like, die, like go go the fuck away. It took no effort to kill them. You would just bonk the one that was uh, that was red, and if you know you had the right build, you'd literally just bonk all of them at once, which is what I tried to do. And it seems like they've changed it to now be more about, um, you know, you're not just going to kill all of them. You need to focus and kill specific ones. Damn, five Titanite. One freaking Titanite shard short. I'm going to say, if I can't do this, I should go and upgrade, but she's not selling Titanite for me yet. So... That is not an option. Actually, you know what? Nope, 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 sir. Ow.
Come on, Horus, let's go. We're gonna beat the shit out of these scrubs together. You and your halberd, me and my scythe. Horus is pretty much gonna be there as as a distraction. Hey, you better back away. Don't wanna mess with Horus. And who else do we got? Henri? Alright, let's go. The whole gang's here. Are you coming? I mean, honestly, Horus, Horus makes sense. He's got a halberd. Henri, she's pretty much just fireball bait. She's just someone to distract them so I can get an easy damage. Because I am going to try and... Ow. One one eighty ish on those hits. Ah, it's like cleaning out a fucking ex it's like a uh, extermination here. Rats. Damn, some of them. Look at that health. They are sitting in the range of 2,000 plus health. No. You don't get it. Fresh fatty? We got fresh fatty spawning. It's not worth killing them at all. I'm just gonna have to. I'm gonna have to focus red while Henri and Horus do their best to distract everything. They can even go into these guys from the buff. Oh lord, I almost forgot about those. That would have been a very sad moment. Bad boy. Damn, dude. Trying to hit these guys. These things are so beefy. Tall dickhead over here. Stop with the fucking fireballs, dude. I might need to come back to this fight. This is insane! Where's Red? Where's Red? Stop that. Fucking Henri's down. Oh my god, it hopped right as I was about to hit him. This is not, we're not pulling this off here, hang on. Oh shit. I can't bone out as long as Horus is alive. Oh, I got a flask, thank god. I'm hop to something weak.
All right, horse. Uh. Oh man, that's all my backstab does. They tickle. Where's the door? Is Horace dead? Nope. Cursed before I could finish it. Alright, well, there's. So there's two possibilities here. Um, the first. Is I just bum rush this shit. I bum rush it as fast as I can. I ignore everything that's not red. Not even worry about clearing out trash. And I hope I can do it before dying. The second is the same exact strategy, but with Henri and Horse. So I think first I'm gonna try and I'm gonna try solo again. Because the scaling on them with summons was pretty freaking outrageous. Um, I'll pop the ember after I'm already in there as a heal. And we're just gonna, we're just gonna, we're gonna try here because this is some next level deacons. Like this is actually really cool because I would argue the deacons was, um, it was pretty much the pushover fight of Dark Souls 3. It was like growling congregation or something like that, you know, just a bunch of things that you didn't care about attacking you and you were like, all right, cool. Jeez, don't hit me. But it never really was a concern. And now it's like, fuck, this is an actual challenge with the, the fireball guys and the beefy guys. Because typically you would just, you know, like I said, run in, smash ass, and then be on your way. hits, get out. Three hits, get out. Ooh, that one burned as it got buff. Honestly, this is dude, this is crazy. This is absolutely crazy. <sighs> um, I'm gonna be honest, y'all. I I think I need to just come back to this later. Um, as ridiculous as that sounds, I mean, a couple things were changed up and. 
I mean, you don't, well, for starters, I know you don't have to beat the Deacons anymore to go to Irithel. I know that was one of the things that were changed, and along with that, the Deacons apparently have been hitting the gym, because this is some levels of intensity. Like, I think it's, a, this is a really cool change to this fight, but damn, the Deacons, I'm gonna have to come back and take them down later. The Deacons are not just your run-of-the-mill steamroll boss anymore, so. On that note, your boy is about to get his souls and then dip the fuck out. And from here, I'm not sure where we'll go next. Um, either High Wall or Karthus. Probably, I mean, if I go through High Wall, I could fight Bort, and then I could go towards Dancer. And I'm not really feeling that yet, so I'm thinking I'll probably go Karthus. But first things first, get that out of my way. Back of the room. And we are getting the hell out of here. So anyway, um, yeah, probably Karthus. I might even hit up Karthus and then work... Well, hang on, though. Let me think here. Because I go through... Where do I get to Wol... Wolnir? No. Okay. Yeah, never mind. We're going to the Swamp. We're going to the Swamp, Abyss Watchers, then Karthus. That would make more sense. Yeah. Okay. All right. Anyway, wrapping up. See you guys next time.